G'day. Today we're doing a bit of work on a Mitsubishi Triton 2011 model. It's got the 4D56 turbo diesel motor in it, 2.5 litre. Come in with a fuel issue. We've just done the timing belts. Remove the radiator, it's a lot easier to, to get there to, to it. But I'll show you a little issue. Have a look at that. You can see how carboned up that is. Almost completely blocked it. And this one's only done 150,000 kilometres. You can see it's thoroughly carboned everything up. And there are all, all your inlets. So it's important to use the right engine oil, the low soot ones. Do a regular engine service or this will happen. That's probably stuck, can't even work. Anyway, we've got to physically clean these. Um, no matter how much you flush it or even a hydrogen carbon clean wouldn't clean this out. You can see there's just too much carbon and sludge there to clean out. I'm going to rotate it off that. Yeah, that's it. Oh, look at that. We've got molasses in here. So you can see the importance of using the correct oil, doing a regu regular service on it. All that will happen. Now on these motors, apart from doing the timing belt and the balance shaft belt on a regular basis, you need to readjust these rockers. If you have a look at this one, look how loose that one is. So that would have been causing a lot of that engine noise. Just would have been tapping around. I don't know if you can see that. There you go. Loose as. So they need periodic adjustment. Sludge. Now we've got all the injectors out. Steve O did clean it up a bit, but all that oil and muck that's gone down into the cylinder is just blasted out again. But I'll do a quick compression test just to see what we're getting there. Spun a little uh, dummy injector there for it, just so we can just get a more accurate pressure reading on that piston. Ready? Yeah. Radio. Ready? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Looks 
looks like 175 there. We'll just go run through and do the rest of them the same way. And we've got number two. Yep. Yep. And that one's gone 210. Number three. Yep. Yep. That one's on about two sixty. Yep, number four. And that one's 150. So it might have something related to the valves or crack in a piston, or maybe the rings are carboned up because it had so much sludge in there. We don't know.